Hi, this is Tutor Nick P, and this is Word Origins 284. The word origin today is bookworm, and we actually have two meanings. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now. Let's get right to it. Um, someone who is an avid book reader, so somebody who likes to really read a lot, much more than the average person. And of course, the second meaning is the literal meaning. Some bugs that may actually live in and eat, especially the glue from book bindings, such bugs include silverfish, book lice, linoleum beetles, etc. Okay, let's continue. The term dates back to the 1500s and was originally a very negative term in the Elizabethan era and meant a wretch, you know, like a very unpleasant, um, you know, not nice person uh, in that sense. So when they called a person a bookworm back then, it was a real insult. Over time, it was used to refer to someone who was well-read Perhaps intellectual and not so sociable. Um, yeah, when I was young, it still had a little bit of this sort of a meaning to it. Not so negative like a wretch or anything like that, but it probably meant that the person, you know, read a lot, but was, you know, not the most popular person. Uh, something along that line. Uh, now the use is more positive. Simply meaning someone who likes to read a lot as a hobby, usually several books per month. And, you know, if we think people read a lot, you know, the chances are they might be smarter or, you know, at least more knowledgeable anyway. All right, let's continue. Uh, and we got four examples to show just how uh, it's used. Here's the first one. You should buy her a book as a present. She loves reading and is a real bookworm. All right, number two. He was a bookworm as a child, spending many hours in his local library every weekend. All right. Number three, his favorite pastime is to go to Barnes and Noble and read books all weekend and drink coffee. He is a real bookworm. Okay. And the last one, number four, he was a bookworm of sci-fi and fantasy novel. So you can say somebody could be a bookworm of just a certain type of a genre or a certain category of books as well. Okay. Anyway, I hope you got it. I uh, hope it was clear. I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.